Do you ever wonder why there is still no recognised test for ME, chronic fatigue syndrome, nor any officially approved effective treatment? Well, here is an illustration which shows the amount of money spent on research into a few illnesses according to the National Institutes of Health in America for 2011. The area of each of these bubbles represents the amount of money spent on that illness. These first two illnesses, lupus and multiple sclerosis, have many similarities with ME. They each have roughly half the number of sufferers in comparison with ME. Depression affects many more people, of course. Diabetes is becoming an ever-increasing problem in the Western world. And HIV-AIDS affects about twice the number of people with ME. Now here's the money spent on research into ME. That's it. You are looking at this in high definition, aren't you? But don't get too excited. At least half of it has been spent on psychological or coping studies. Some of the rest was spent looking at rats who had been made to swim until they almost drowned. Well, that is fatigue, isn't it? The amount spent on what you or I would describe as biomedical research is absolutely tiny.